Hello, all you happy people. Welcome to another episode of the Funko Addict. Now, I know it's irregular to see my face, but I thought, hey, it's the Comic Con Hall. Let's make it special. Also, we won't be recording in my office as normal. Um, my girlfriend's just taken over the office, so she's actually designing a Venom cosplay. I hope to do that later on. Hey, guys. So, the first piece that I got is this awesome printout done by Jesus Mourinho. Now he is one of the major DC artists. He recently did uh, Just League Dark, The Witching Hour. So guys, this is an awesome piece. Plus, I mean, there's Batman in the back, and if you know me, I'm a massive Batman fan. Bit of an understatement, but yes. So guys, that's a really awesome piece that I got. Then another piece I got, this awesome Spider-Man. It actually looks like it's from the video game. Done by Will Sliney and it's signed. So guys, these two prints, I'm gonna give the Jesus Mourinho one. Four out of five Batman. And the Will Sliney, five out of five Spider-Man swinging through the city. <laughs> All right guys, so this is another really awesome one that I picked up. It is the P exclusive Red Death that does not want to stand. Um, so that will weigh against it. Hey! Okay, somehow it stands. So guys, this is a really awesome pop. It actually looks like he's running. So guys, if you go check out, this is from the Metal series. I do have the Batman Who Laughs one. I'm gonna leave him like that so you can stand. Nope, okay. So I'm gonna have to give this three out of five Batmans just because he refuses to stand, as you can see. So he's going straight back in his box once we're done recording so that he can actually look very, very awesome. Okay, next piece is the awesome Comic-Con Africa Kakashi. As you can see, very, very good looking pop. Very, very detailed. So as somebody who's coming from an outside, not a Naruto fan, I'll be honest, this is Ruby's. I would say I'm going to give this a 5 out of 5 Nine Tails. Okay guys, now i got to be honest, this one here I didn't get from Comic Con Africa, but I did get very recently, like the Wednesday, is Luke Hobbs, and I specifically got this one from Janine. Now if you guys have seen the Hobbs and Shaw movie, it was amazing, and I've been hunting for Luke Hobbs since well, I started collecting pops. As you can see, it's a very, very basic stance for a pop. Has the gun, bulletproof vest, obviously the rock's bald head. And what's very nice and very detailed is the eyebrow, which the rock is very well known for. So I'm going to give this a 3 out of 5 car crashes. Okay guys, now this is one of the big highlights of my hoard is the Vlad Dracula Tepez from Castlevania. Now I saw this and I needed the entire collection. I have the entire collection. Now if you guys want me to do a review on the entire collection, just let me know and I'll do so. But I walked into one of these small indie sellers that were there and I found this, bought it instantly. As you can see, very, very awesome. I was worried that his body was going to be a bit too small, even as the cape, the pointy ears. So this may be a bit biased, I'm going to give this 5 out of 5 vampires, just because of how excited I am to finally have this in my own collection. Okay, now I'm sure that some of you guys have already got this also, is a pop signed by David Angelo Roman. So this is really cool because he actually drew a sketch of the character on the one side. Now I'm not going to review this one just because I've already, this is one of my older pops, um, but it's one of my top characters. So guys, this is a really awesome one. Also speaking of David Angelo Roman, we got Pickle Rick signed by him, well let me rephrase it, Ruby did, and got Pickle Rick drawn on the side. So that's really, really cool. 
Now guys, this is the new Cosmic Comics exclusive, the Patina Captain America. Now I know Comic-Con had the Wolverine, the Iron Man, and I think one other, and Rage is the Spider-Man. So this is a really good one to grab. Quite like that it's the more classic looking Captain America, and it's a bobblehead. It doesn't seem to like to stand, which I will weigh against it. But otherwise, guys, very, very cool looking pop. Um, yeah, so I'm going to give this a 3 out of 5 Captain America throwing his mighty shield. Okay guys, now here is the absolute corner piece, the centerpiece for my haul. Is my own personalized season 1 box set of the originals signed by Daniel Gillies. So guys, this is so awesome that I'm going to give it 5 out of 5 vampires straight. I mean, I'm so thoroughly happy with this. Also got it authenticated. That's the wrong way. You guys, this is really, really cool. Thoroughly happy with this. And yeah. So guys, that's my haul from Comic-Con Africa. I'm incredibly happy about it. As you can see, got some very, very awesome stuff. And I think I may have gone a bit overboard with pops. Without further ado, I've been the Funko Addict, you guys have been great, hope you all had an awesome Comic Con, please remember to leave your hauls in the comments below, also remember to like our Facebook page, and go and subscribe to our YouTube channel please. Anyway, I've been the Funko Addict, you guys have been great, have a great day, and we'll see you in the next video, bye bye!